I got my first drum at five, and then I started playing on a set at 11, 12 years old, somewhere in that range. Then I got into turntables, or then I got into beat making, then I got into turntables, but I don't know how to play anything, you know, I don't know how to play the piano. Anything melodic, I don't know how to play. Turntable was originally something you walked away from when you put a record on, you know? You never thought to sit there and look at it and say, what else can I do with this? You're not supposed you, to, you never were supposed to touch it. Yeah, it was so... And your parents were like, don't touch the turntable. Yeah. Don't touch the record, you're gonna ruin it. I was 11 years old, and I heard Rocket um, by Herbie Hancock, the DST scratching on it. It was, ship, ship, shrewd. And I grabbed the shirt. The Jurassic create songs with each other. We go about it in different ways. A lot of times, Cut or I will have a beat, and we will come to, to the table with a beat. Are you guys feeling this? Yes or no? Sometimes they're in here writing it. Sometimes they write on their own. Sometimes they write together. There's been tracks where the beat's been playing in the studio while everybody's just vibing out, just talking. There's times when we don't really have the rhyme or the guys don't really have the rhyme together and they lay down this mock track just to see how it goes, just to get the patterns and the, you know, the fluctuations and everything. Go back and fill them with the words so I can go later back and program it around what they're doing. It's fun, but it's always a challenge. Y'all know Babu out there? Yeah. The people's on the right, y'all know Babu? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, attention, oh, ladies and gentlemen, oh, ladies and gentlemen, oh, Yo, to me it don't matter how dope you write or look. MCs without a voice should write a book. For this era right now, I guess for what the media has portrayed as rap music has been very limited. And I think with Dilated, we just brought it back to the basics. I mean, the reason that I even connected with Evidence and Rocka was because they didn't want a DJ for, 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 for fake reasons. They didn't want someone up there. You know, they could have anybody if they just wanted a stage prop DJ. But they themselves are very involved in, the, in all the elements of the culture of hip hop. They both started as graffiti writers and applied those same mentalities to their MCing and Evidence also as, as a producer. So their respect for the DJ is, goes without question. You know, so for me to be involved in any aspect of the group, whether it's recording, on stage, interviews, anything like that, you know, they totally include me as a complete third of the group. And um, it feels right.